Let me ask you, last week, um, Andy Apiakubi was on one of our programs. Um, uh, this was uh, a program hosted by my colleague, Raymond Aqua, on, and he said, made a, been a, been a pronouncement that he's warning those in, in the party and in government who are attempting to influence, you know, he was a, he was a mouthpiece that day at the press conference, influence his side with materialism and material uh, things to try and change course as far as Ken Oferiata is concerned to, to back off. There's a suggestion there that since they went public and since you met the president, there are forces now attempting to use material promises to try and influence your, your members in the House. I am not aware of that. Um, I'm not privy to whatever uh, inducements uh, that people are offering. I'm not privy to that at all. Uh, as I told you, I've been away since Thursday. I've heard, though, that um, some, some businessman came here, uh, was it the Thursday that I left? I came here Thursday early morning and left around, uh, I think, 10 o'clock or so uh, to where we're having the cabinet retreat. I'm told on authority that some businessman uh, business came here and uh, tried to do something. Um, he's a businessman that I know. Honestly, I've not spoken with him ever since I heard that matter. And I don't want to, you know, uh, cite him here. But I've not spoken with him. Uh, I was told that he came here and, and tried to uh, mediate in his in his own way what he thinks the problem is and uh, try to. This uh, is a wealthy businessman, is he? Come again. This is a wealthy businessman, is he? Is a is a wealthy businessman that uh, people know, um, and so that's all that I I, uh, I know about it. But he was. Um, repelled by, by uh, the people and told, he was told to, uh, not to involve himself. So he went away. So that's all that I've heard. I don't know of any other thing. Okay. I mean, he wasn't here on the, on the authority of Ken Ofriata, was he? I've not spoken with him. And I don't want to be presumptuous. Okay. And the suggestion, well, and the could be also a republic. I mean, he didn't make going into detail. But, of course, businessmen in Ghana have a reputation in these matters um, yeah. of, of using their wealth to try and influence. If that is what is ha is something you want to look into? Well, if that is the case, I want to, I want to talk to uh, that man and know his motive. But, I mean, people could also be indulging in speculation. So I want to, I want to hear him to see what it is. Did he come here? What, did he come with any inducement? What was the motivation? Not having heard him, I don't want to prejudge. Anything. Is he an MPP financier? Not that I know of. But he's known to be affiliated or has sympathies for the party. Well, he's a businessman. I know that he deals with both sides of the of, of the political divide. Not if you want me to pin him down to any political uh, party, uh, I think it would be difficult for me to do that because I know that you know he, he has his own way of dealing with. Uh, both sides of the political divide. Okay.